Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please remember to take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Um, so Pisces, I'm really glad to be on your reading right now. Cause, damn. I mean, it's real. The pressure out there is real, especially with this eclipse coming. And, uh, I feel like all it's doing is, is turning you into a diamond. Because it's almost like you're, you're seeing through all the facades. You're seeing through anybody who's trying to dump their shit on you. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, the pressure is real. You're moving positively into your into your uh, destiny, which is your four wands, all right, foundations and achievements, and despite anybody's best efforts to hold you down, all that pressure is doing is turning you into something shiny, yeah, so somebody's real jealous of you here, real jealous of your destiny, and heartbroken maybe even you're you're disappointed in your in, in something here you're disappointed that somebody of some of something that you thought was positive movement forward and it, it turned out to be that it was like uh -huh. well that wasn't it And unlike a lot of other signs, Pisces, you're you're able to keep moving despite anybody's best effort to try to blame you for their stuff. You know, I feel like I feel like it's like okay. So do I? I don't want to give that reference, Spirit. I don't want to give that reference because that that will that will incur a lot of these people, and I I just don't want to hear it today. I'm not in the mood. Uh, but say everything's all your fault because you just happen to be there kind of energy you just happen to be there so it's all your fault whether it was or not and this, is, this is the blame game that a lot of other people play so because you're moving forward in a positive way and possibly there's some maybe union or, or spiritual contract coming in or something of that nature that you were hoping is coming in somebody's back here saying well the only reason why I'm failing is because you were there keep the hope alive Pisces stand in your own authority and don't let anybody tell you who you are or you know you're the reason why they're a failure you know if, you, if you're moving forward, keep moving forward. And don't let these haters. And I said this in my general reading. I got a comment that said. Um, they they hate. Then they, they sent it in a, in a different language. I had to translate it. But they said it in a European language. I'm not going to say which one. But uh, they left this in the comments that. They can't stand the air on this planet because of me. That sounds like a you problem. Whoever you are. Sounds like a you problem. Like I said, all you got to do is be there, Pisces, and this person wants to blame you for everything that's wrong in their life. You don't even have to do anything. 177 right off the bat. Maybe somebody had high hopes of you that maybe you were going to put up with their bullshit and you didn't. And somebody needs to stop blaming you for their problems. They really do. They really, really do. Obstacles and challenges. Movements, choices, and decisions. With hope. The universe knows what you've been through. And that you still have hope despite anybody's best efforts to... Um, 
put an obstacle in your way, which, you know, they do that, they do that because of their own shadow Pisces. I know it's hard to understand t sometimes, especially when you just want to move forward away from the hate. You know, I mean, move forward anyway. No matter what obstacles and challenges is in your way, you are a mutative sign. You can make this happen. And the universe knows your strength. The strength of your heart. And what you do have to offer this world. The universe knows. Despite your obstacles and challenges. You've made some positive choices here Pisces. And despite your haters. Despite people tell you. Just, just by you being here. They hate the air on this planet. That's pretty bad. That's pretty rough. Maybe because they're not manifesting what they want because they're too busy paying attention to what you're doing. There's some some form of partnership or alliance coming in for you. Somebody wants to tap into your wisdom because, like I said, you, no matter what the obstacles and challenges was here, you kept moving positively forward and brought something into fruition through your what do I want to say because you hung in there um, what, what is that word I'm looking for I don't know but somebody wants to tap into your wisdom of how you did this and they're going to pull they're going to help pull you out of whatever this obstacle and challenge is because they see this person too <clears throat> excuse me so they they see this person too the hermit energy with uh, another five prosperity begins somebody sees what you've been through here pisces and they're recognizing you for that they see this other person too that is behind the scenes like a puppeteer controlling things that maybe you don't even know are there maybe you don't want to know pisces is like that we don't we don't want to know you know if you don't like the air on this planet because i live here you know that's a you problem i can't help you yeah so look 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 there's some kind of partnership that's going to come in and allow you to to level up but this person wants to get in the way pisces and they're stressing because they know that that they're out of time with this with this pisces full moon eclipse they know they're about to be eclipsed out they know it so they're going to throw one last shot one last shot each time but you keep overcoming it you keep moving forward even though they keep throwing stuff at you it's like while you're climbing the hill they're rolling boulders down it trying to make you fight every single step of the way and i don't know why they do this pisces i really don't it doesn't make any sense to me because I ain't not I ain't not hurting anybody intentionally, and I love people, so I would never tell them that you're the reason why I don't like this air on this planet. You know, I would never say that because I love all people, even the even the haters, even the people who who are disgusted by my presence. You know, that's a them problem, and I've realized that it's taken me a long time. To realize that they weren't able to stop your work they weren't able to stop you from moving forward no matter what they say no matter what they did no matter what rumors were spread no matter what lies were said this person was not able to stop something and you you've taken it and you've transformed it you you've taken it and let something be over and because you let it be over you're letting this be over the five of wands you're not this person 
goes out of their way to stress you out and pressure you and make you feel like you're not good enough because you simply exist not not for any other reason you just simply exist you didn't do nothing to this person I don't feel like or these people they just They just don't like your existence, Pisces. Like I said, that's a them problem. You do not have to people please anymore. That's over. And they know it. They know it. That's why they're 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 throwing boulders. Because they know that there's some kind of partnership or alliance coming in here. Maybe even it's just a collective that um is going to give you a hand up. Yeah, this is somebody from the past who's definitely confused about who they are. They were confused about your leadership. Perhaps they misjudged you. And that now they're confused about how you were able to level up because they've been trying to unalive you the whole time. And they're confused. They're, they're stressed and confused. Why? You're still standing? Oh my God. But that pressure has turned you into a diamond. Instead of letting it destroy you. It has changed you. And they're confused how you changed the past. How you changed something simply by walking away. You ate a cup stick. You put a fork in it. The death god is here. Perhaps you faced death head on. And you kind of went, is that all you got, coward? And you were hopeful. I, I do feel like, you know, you are definitely still in a hopeful state. You're not allowing these people to keep throwing you under the bus to make you second guess yourself. You're still bossing up. You're still taking responsibility. You're still being some kind of leader in helping a group or a, a, a And maybe hoping to find your person if you haven't found them yet. Okay? This could have been somebody in your past that maybe they were a boss. Maybe they were somebody who had some kind of power. But they were confused about you. I don't think you're going to take anybody back from the past, Pisces. Or a past life. Because somebody was very cruel here. They wanted to see you gone, not breathing the same air on this planet as them. Yet, you overcame with nothing but hope. You transformed it. And perhaps you are hoping that your relationships transform as well. But, you know... You do, you do see through the illusion. You see through the masks. These people are losing their masks. They're not able to hide them anymore. It's like, like so obvious it hurts. Like, like I said, it's so obvious to you. Like when somebody says, well, that would have ha never happened had you not been there. And you were just there. You're just existing. So like I said, it's so obvious that it hurts but don't let it become an obstacle in your way because it's just pressure Pisces it's pressure to turn you into that diamond so you stop second guessing yourself so you stop thinking that somebody else has power over your happiness because they don't it's a them problem and you are not people pleasing anymore 
It's not, it's not your destiny. It's your destiny to change that. No matter what pressure is brought to your door. To stop self-sacrificing for other people just to make them happy. Stop it. Don't do it anymore. There is some kind of painful permanent ending happening right now for you or for whoever this other person is that has been attacking you. I do feel like there's a serious attack here that five of wands and that death card and the nine of swords yeah some kind of serious attack they know their time is up so they're coming at you like like with everything they got it's gonna cost them Pisces be compassionate but do not do not deny who you are right now right here and in the scheme of things because this is leading to something much much better than somebody else blaming you for them not being happy like I said it's a them problem Pisces and you need to let them handle it of their own accord you can't save them from their painful permanent ending nor can you save you yourself from your own if you entertain these energies this jealousy this envy this you know um, what is that uh, thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's stuff because that's what this person is doing and, and your very existence is a threat to them. Because you're not doing, you're not acting the same way they are. Look at this. This fight is coming to a close. And they know it. Five of Swords to the World card. Closing out cycles. Like I said, they are, this is, this pressure is real, Pisces. I feel it too, babies. The pressure that, like I said, you know, you simply being there is bothering them. It doesn't have anything to do with you. This could be somebody, you know, like you go to a, a fancy restaurant to go out to dinner and you meet somebody and you go to a fancy restaurant and you go out to dinner and before you even get to your table, this person is irritated, aggravated, and, 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 and is treating you like, like you're the problem. Well, if you go to a nice restaurant and there's a wait, it usually means it's a really good restaurant. So Pisces is a patient being. They're willing to wait. This other person is sitting there going, mm -hmm. and irritated by everything it's going on because they're not a happy person that's a them problem Pisces not a you problem so don't make yourself feel bad about it yeah yeah you're you're cutting out this is your judgment your final judgment of this five of swords five of wands five of swords you're you're cutting it out but that is what's bringing in some kind of new partnership through your wisdom because somebody sees what you're dealing with. They see it. Somebody's going to come in and offer you some kind of a, a new alliance, a new partnership, a new way of being because, like I said, you took all that pressure, condensed it, and turned it into a diamond because you cut out things that no longer serve you. Which is the judgment of you by others. And you're standing on your own two feet. In celebratory energy. Because it's your truth. King and Queen of Swords. You're not apologizing for being yourself anymore. Which is a level up. 
Okay, so we got the swing swing. So somebody's obsessed with you, Pisces. They're obsessed with your brand new passionate beginning and they want to stop it. Because they want it. They want it. They want to keep it for themselves. While you're over here defending your peace. This person may even say, well, let's call a truce. Let, let's work things out, you know. And, and Pisces, you being you, you usually say, okay, well, let's write. You know, we're, we're like that. We're like, you know what? Yeah, okay. Peace. But I feel like with you, Pisces, now, you're, you're not dealing with the confusion anymore. You're leveling up. Okay? I got peace because... I'm not allowing you in my space. So there, there you go. I mean, extra, extra read all about it. Somebody's about to get caught for their offer, for their, the way that they're behaving. It's erratic. It's, it's very erratic. They want to call a truce before they have, have to deal with their own karma. They think that's going to get them out of their karma, Pisces. It's not. And there ain't anything you can do about it, so don't you feel responsible for it. You hear me? We have the uh, hanged man. Like I said, there's some kind of obstacle somebody's trying to put in your way to try to get you to self-sacrifice here. Like, like, like telling you that, you know, you bother them so much just by being alive that you shouldn't be here. That's a magic trick trying to ruin your good. It's a lie. It's a total lie. Virgo, Gemini energy with Pisces energy. It's a total lie. Seven of Swords. And, and, and it's in vain because whoever's doing this, you know what they're doing. You can see it. It's like I can see you. And I'm st and you're still doing it. It's, it's almost like watching a child like repeat the same mistake over and over again and and you're getting frustrated with it but i don't feel like you're it's just pressure and you're not you're not letting it get to your emotions pisces you are defending yourself you're defending your home you're defending your your this queen of wands Oh, like I said, they want you gone, Pisces. I, I can't. And even if they you call a truce with this person, it's not going to stop them from from trying to see your demise. Four of Wands, Seven of Swords, Three of Cups, and the Five of Swords. They're doing everything they can to defeat you, Pisces. They know they're about out of time. And they're doing it for money. What else? You know? They're doing it for abundance of some kind. Trying to get you to self-sacrifice. They're jealous of your abundance. They're jealous of your accolades. They're jealous of whatever it is that you've manifested. And this fight is about to be over once and for all. And when it is... Don't blame yourself for what they've manifested. Okay? Uh, I'm gonna, I, I'm, I want you to really understand that, Pisces. You are not responsible for pleasing everybody here. You are responsible for your own soul and your soul alone. And if you feel like you're right and just and... You want, just want to be happy, despite anybody's best efforts to try that, try to make that different. As long as you're you're not hurting anybody else and you're just doing you, boo. You do you, boo. You do you, and and don't worry about what everybody else has got to say. You can't help it. You're here and you're doing you. You can't help it that you're being the person that you are. And anybody don't like it. They don't like your self-love. They don't like your Ace of Cups. New love's coming in for you. New truth. New love. 
And, and it, this has been your truth all along. You've been standing in it all along. That's your judgment. That's your will of fortune. That's your destiny. And there's the chariot shall ride again with the empress. Like I said, some form of cruelty here. You will overcome this, Pisces. It might not seem like it at the moment. Because it's a demon. I mean, they ain't got nothing better to do. They ain't got nothing better to do. They could go get a life and leave you alone, but they find it much fun, much more fun to <clears throat> poke at the bear at their own demise here. And that's what I feel like is going on. Trying to rob you, take your creation, toxic energy, and plagiarism. Community group, gang stalking, body snatcher, doppelganger, stealing identity. Yeah, well, this ain't going to work no more. Five of Swords to the World card twice. It's going to close. And you're finding this, your true self through discovery and purpose. Like I said, you're taking all that pressure on. You're compressing it. And you're turning it into a diamond. Because the masks are falling off of these keyboard warriors who are cowards. For their ego and, and desires and entitlement. They think they have to your energy. So they're trying to ruin your rep so they can take your accolades. They're nothing but a scammer. Black hat. Somebody who's an op. See it for what it is. And don't blame yourself for the way other people feel about you. It's not your problem. Betrayal. Deceit. Backstab. Traitor. Not to be trusted. Absolutely. Oh, I'm sorry. But it's fake. Because they were fulfilling a fantasy here. They thought you was a fantasy, Pisces. Maybe if you went out on a date, they got pulled over after... <laughs> after they left. Who knows? Yeah, they, they got caught with something. Somebody got caught with something here. Red lipstick stain. Situation about to explode. I, guess I think the last the last uh, reading I did was you sitting there with your popcorn, Pisces, with, ready to watch the total drama go down. Because you know this is about to pop off. You know you can feel it. Like I said, this, this is like pressure. But you do feel like there's going to be some sort of release and the record will be set straight because there's some kind of recorded evidence that will put this person in their place. Could just be a simple comment like, I don't like the air on this planet because you're in it. I mean, that could be all the evidence somebody needs. That could be all the evidence somebody needs. Because that's what they're wishing on you. It's, that's throwing you negative disgusting energy the enlightened gut star royalty and lightning boy I've gotten this for you before Pisces so I'm going to read this one because I, I do feel like like I said don't doubt yourself don't doubt your gut here you're right if you, if you feel like you're right. Like I said, it's, it's just li like the um, analogy of going out to a nice dinner with somebody but, you know, and and you're in a, it's a great restaurant. It's really busy. You know, you know it's a great restaurant because it's really busy, you know. Uh, you, you might have to wait a little while. But while you're waiting, this person becomes very irritated and aggravated and it makes it an unpleasant an unpleasant experience as opposed to what it could have been had they had not been so irritated just by accepting 
hey, this is a great restaurant, so we're going to hang, you know? We're going to wait our turn, because this is a great restaurant. Some people are just like that, Pisces, and that's a them problem. Okay, I'm going to read you the Star Royalty, because I do feel like it's reminding you of what you're here to do shine no matter what anybody does here because like I said this pressure is hardcore and you feeling it and you seeing it I mean you see it like a child doing something wrong over and over and over again and you get frustrated to the point where you just want to correct them don't correct them Pisces because that's a them problem and you've got to learn how to do your thing without trying to people please everybody else okay trying to make them happy and shrink yourself down because this is this is what they want you to do your, your royalty baby you step into your power with your gut even if ain't nobody likes it this says says how we define royal uh, you know who you are you know why you came you are made of the essence of star royalty how we define royalty on the Pleiades is much different from how it can be seen on your earth. Those that are royal to our societies aren't ones born into certain blood lineages, but those whom have done the work within themselves to know on, a, on such a deep level that they are one with all of the source creation. This anchored unity and with source brings these beings into such a wonderful state that they are able to perform the miraculous by harnessing the energy which creates universes universes <laughs> and using it to serve the collective this is possible through self-discovery and their declaration that one is royalty the star royalty card arrives when you are being requested to make a proclamation that you are royal I am royal you have done the internal work went on your soul journeys and climbed to the mountains that people were throwing boulders down at you um, climb the mountains of yourself to uncover the many inner gifts along the way now is the time that your life will be recognized without any hint of downplaying your true full worth. This is what I'm saying. Don't dull your shine just to please other people, Pisces. You got to stop doing that. Because you are who you are. You are who you say you are. Don't forget that. Let that light shine. By making the declaration that you are royal, you can proclaim to the universe that you are an empowered being sent here to transform consciousness and serve creation as you reside in the planet of harmonious balance this act of declaring your royalty takes away any power and resources from shadow leaders that abuse their privilege privilege to equalize out the playing field naturally see the importance of honoring of self and sit in the energy of thankfulness for the being that is you self gratitude kindness empowerment inner knowing coming into the light celebration of the self worthiness and becoming whole victory commit to self worth by writing all the aspects this is an exercise you could do so commit to self worth by writing all the aspects to yourself that you love and admire attempt to go deep and experience any challenging moments of when there might have looked like no hope and still have hope and how you overcame the situation to arrive in the here and now make this a time of celebration for the beauty that is you I love the way that ended because this was very, this was very 
what I want to say, it was a lot of pressure you're going through right now, Pisces. So, still see who you are and what you came here to do with hope. No matter what anybody's throwing at you here, my babies, they will be held accountable, you know, by the universe, if by nothing else. I think they're already being held accountable, and that's why they're, they're coming at you so hard, all right? And those are your messages, my baby shocks. I love you very much. And I'll see you today at 3 for the live stream. Till then, take care. Bye for now.